One of the things that I'm a huge fan of in Procreate, I'm not sure if everybody uses it. It's not turned on by default, but it's the quick menu. And it's the quick menu is a menu that you turn on. I have it on touch mode. You have to kind of go into prefs here and the settings, gesture control, quick menu, and I set it to touch. So when I just set my finger down, it recognizes the Apple Pencil, right? So if, I, if I'm just drawing, then I'm drawing with a pencil. But if I'm putting my finger on the screen, it recognizes that as the touch. So I can just drag in, I just put my finger down, drag in one direction to flip canvas, for example. And if I do it quickly, you don't even see it happening. So I can go from eraser to brush super quickly. So I can be working on my, let's say that I'm putting in a layer here. I'm picking color, let's touch hold. And then selecting one of my favorite brushes. So I'm drawing, maybe working on the eye here. Let's say it's gonna have bigger eyes like that. And then I'm flipping canvas. And then I want to erase a little. And then the brush, so I'm just dragging up, dragging down. So it's super, it makes your workflow super fast if you set up your quick menu as you want it. And you can tailor each, each thing, you know? You can set it up to be your special six ninja tricks right there. And then you have like a three finger down, you get this menu, you can copy paste. So all this uh, gesture stuff and especially the quick menu that's a that's a really a one that as soon as I got used to it after Procreate came out with it I couldn't not have it there you know it's uh, just became the second nature so fast it's like the two finger undo you just tap to with two fingers you undo you tap with three fingers you redo once you set up your gestures you almost never have to go to the menu if you're used to your uh, Photoshop uh, shortcuts, then this will replace that. Once you set up your gesture controls here, so it has to be, you know, it has to be this one on, on touch, right? And then you just tap with the finger, just touch the screen, and, and this will pop up right away. And then you touch hold on each of these buttons. So then you get the huge menu. You can also like pick select the brush for example to be like because these two are my favorite brushes or two of the ones that I use the most and then flip horizontally of course that's a that has to be there alpha lock and then erase and paint so that's sometimes I'll switch this with drawing assist if I'm doing like a perspective drawing then I will touch all this and put drawing assist instead because then I can flick on and off the the perspective drawing 